Good morning, afternoon, and evening, everyone. This is Kippy Tesla. Welcome to episode 11 of Psychonauts 2. Meteor well, not meteorologist. Clairvoyance says this will be second to last episode, but we're like probably not gonna finish the last step, uh, level in one episode. I remember it was a big level, there was a lot. We can't just breeze through that shit. You gotta sit down after each cutscene and be like, and then continue, which takes some extra time. <laughs> How's everyone doing? <clears throat> Hello, Chad. Hello, Zombie Chow. That is absurd, my dude. I did not know that I was trying to be like, I'll show him how to do a middle finger. Here, just emoji panel and... Where's my middle finger? What you... Where did you do my... Apparently, this emoji are being censored now. Can This can't be an emoji. Am I be? Am I gonna be... Am I gonna be cancelled for... Like, what if, what if you have an injury and you're like, this is the only way you can go around. You're like, you walk past the camera like this... Instantly, they shoot the finger off. It's it's ridiculous, but what can you do? I guess we'll just have to suffice. We'll have to make our own middle finger. See if it passes the Twitch. Because uh, this is this is like the emoji panel on the on the OS on Windows. I wonder. I wonder. So I can't like if I'm trying to say I'm cooking an eggplant, actual f deep fried eggplant or eggplant burgers. What am I supposed to use, huh? Egg and plant next to each other? Then someone was gonna say, ha ha, testicle metaphor. We don't take kindly to testicles around these parts. <laughs> Jesus. Why peach? Peach. Like peachka? <laughs> really, why peach? Because it looks like a butt? Or is it supposed to represent vagina? A vagina? Because that would be a funny one. In Serbian and pretty sure in many Slavic languages, the usual slang for vagina, what you would say, I guess, I guess in English it would be kant, is pichka. So pichka. Like peach, you just add ka at the end. It's like little peach. I guess freedom of expression, <laughs> only to some. <laughs> what was it? It was one of the... Ah, was it was it one of the leaders or was it communism in general? Communism in general. Well, it was like, uh, we're all equal, but some are more equal. No, wait, that was Animal Farm. That's right, that was Animal Farm, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, yeah was it? Yeah. <laughs> all the animals are equal, but some are more equal. <laughs> but it's... That, I love that. It's genius. I keep... Whenever I say Animal Farm, I want to switch to 1984 or us. We. I don't know how they translated it in English, but yeah. But it's neither. It's Animal Farm, which is also mind fucking. How you doing, guys? Mayo. Mayo, my man. Chipka. Chipka. <laughs> Chipka is a lace. So Pichka is a vagina. Chipka is a lace. Why am I saying ch? Like I'm, a, like I'm from Pirot. <laughs> yeah, it would be like a lace. <laughs> so Pichka Chipka would be a laced pussy. <laughs> Zombie, you working today? Let's see, S Saturday, Saturday, it's like counting, you know, like you count, uh, you, you know, the 31 and 30 day months, I forgot how you do, but that's what I do with zombies work day. So I go like Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, you're off today, aren't you? Ella, wake update in, oh, lost me, but lost me at dead by daylight. Oh, there, oh, there, I have a, I want to see the Alan Wake intro, big Alan Wake fan here. Ella Wake is on the streaming list for this year, on the playlist, but Ella, uh, <laughs> DVD, man, they put fucking Chuck in DVD, I, have, I haven't played DVD in what, love, a year, has it been a year? Yeah. Stop teleporting, you were here just now, <laughs> uh, it, it's been always here. <laughs> it is good, I'm actually huh? excited. Okay, okay. I hate the updates, but this actually looks good. Sasha likes DVD. I do not like DVD. 
<laughs> DVD and all the ballerinas that play it, you know, because they do the same thing. Like the, there's no dodge mechanic, but people still dodge. They do the little pirouette. They just go wee, and you're invulnerable. <laughs> You're here, so no, yeah, it makes sense. You can't watch from work anymore. They caught him watching from work, and they took his phone and banned Twitch on his phone. I kid, but it would be a good, cool story, wouldn't it, zombie? Like a kid, they take your phone, and your bo boss is like, all right, Twitch is banned from our company. No one can access Twitch. Everybody look at Zombie Chow, because that's his real name. Everybody look at Zombie Chow. This guy is the reason why nobody can watch Twitch now at work, right? Not that you should watch Twitch at work, but Zombie Chow, the reason, no. <laughs> nah. how's the uh, how's 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 mobile net treating you lately as you can see mine only fucks around when we're playing outbreak i think it's the saturday evening but uh yeah knock on wood it hasn't happened in two weeks but i don't want to call it in you know i don't want to i don't want to cause some fuss hey we're getting into this last level guys this is gonna be intense and i do mean it's gonna be fucked up it's not at all what you'd expect so wow the game just puts us where we ended last time so the final cutscene we bought we brought bob zanotto where is the there it is the the gray bearded guy over there has been like hasn't baited in 20 years and we'll see. the final ingredient we needed basically to free the astrolate we brought nana who's actually Maligula, but then Bob uh, Truman Zanotto came in and he's like, oh, I'll take her, so we can tell right away that it's not, it's not Truman in that body, it's, yeah. it's someone in Truman's, oh wait, we don't need the interlacing, that's right, I can turn that off, see, I almost forgot, you gotta do that manually, disable, whoop, do you need me to, okay, no, no latency whatsoever, no, nice, you know, I've, Sasha and I are really, really, really thinking about how, how is it living in Poland. It can't be so hard to learn the Yazik, the Yazik, <laughs> the language. I already know ch, ch, j, sh. You probably have, like, I know Y, I know W, I know six letters already from Polish alphabet. They have more letters? That's not a letter. Did you just you try gagging on me? <laughs> That's not a voice. Yeah, no, they, they, uh, they saw an L. I was like, no, and they got, Ugh. So it's a No, it's a What? Hey. Wombichow. I didn't know that. <laughs> I'll just hire a zombie to teach me Polish. We'll just, we'll just, fuck it. No, seriously, we've been looking into, the, half of the shit we have here is from Poland. My favorite beer is from Poland. My favorite milk is from Poland. My favorite Outbreak player is from Poland. I guess it's just time to move to Poland. But you know, I do joke, but it's it ha we haven't really thinking about it. Like just weighing in the options. Everywhere shit right now, but some places is less shit. At least they have good milk and beer there. Hello, mother of hippie. Welcome. Zdravo majko, dobro došla, dobro veče. Kako ste mi roditelji? All right, let's get into. Oh uh, yeah, they all they all want my attention here. Yes, Lily. Can I talk to people? Let's talk to uh, everybody. Start with Lily. Lily, Raz, listen. I've been following my dad for a while, and he's acting really weird. Hmm. We need to get to the bottom of this. How? Oh, Maya says, wanted to get Yakuza 8 day one. Oh, really? Until the new game plus is behind Deluxe. Yeah, I just, you just spoiled my lunch, dude. Like, why did you do that? It's, Ugh. Really? That's the idea? Is that how far we've come in game development? We're gonna be like... <laughs> $70 for the game, but 50 more for everything past the first level. <laughs> Get out of here, that can't be right. You, sh you probably read it on the joke website, Mayo. That can't be like for real. New game plus behind the paywall. Spoiler alert, New Game Plus always within the base game. Yeah, it always has been within the... Yeah. <laughs> Here's the Pokemon Remake Generation 1, 151. Was it 151? Yeah. Well, you pay now $60, you get three Pokemon, the starters. For the rest, you pay another $120. <laughs> what are you going to do? We're the, only we're the only Pokemon makers here, so... 
<laughs> I can't even be sleazy for that long <laughs> while rubbing my nipple. What next? What next is going to be? <laughs> controller. Buy a new controller. Controller now. Buttons come next year. <laughs> You gotta buy, you gotta pay that premium for, you know, for the A button. So you get all the buttons, except for the A button. Ugh. Oh yeah, so many layoffs. So yeah, we should probably address that. I just jumped into Psychonauts, because I'm fucking psyched on Nauts. <laughs> but, already so many. I read somewhere, like 4,000 layoffs in the gaming industry, or maybe I'm underestimating. That's a lot of people still, without work, for all at once. And, uh, I haven't old man hippie i have been saying for a few years actually almost 10 years now that uh quite possibly very probable <laughs> we could expect another video game crash what they call a video game crash it's really a market crash isn't it but for a long time for a long time yeah for the longest time the mar market has been oversaturated there's so many games man it, they are more affordable, so 60 bucks now isn't what 60 bucks was 1998 when I really wanted to play that uh, new, brand new Resident Evil 2 that costed a kidney. Now it doesn't really cost a kidney, it costs more like, I don't know, liver? Li liver? People can live without livers. Yeah, liver? Like, they can't really, but you know what, I, what I'm getting at. Re livers can regenerate, so we'll take a piece of your liver and, you know, it'll regenerate further, and then we'll take another piece. It, it, it's too much on on average and people keep saying you know gaming has never been more profitable you know so ma many people yeah it is accessible way more accessible way more way more many people buy games sure a million seller now is like a 10k seller my god Truman you look weird from this <laughs> just speaking over there well I'm, I'm gonna move this hold on just move it down move it down there yeah but when it turns, yeah, that. <laughs> but like, the thing is, the thing that makes it not so easy is that, yeah, there's revenue from the games, but profit, pff, they need a lot more green dough to get to green dough, <laughs> to get to profit nowadays, you know. So they got to pay off the whole budget. Uh, yeah, I've, may or not have been chatting about this actually quite recently, maybe two days ago, who knows. I sure don't. And it takes so much to just pay off the budget and everything that profitability comes much later. So, yeah, there's been way more, there's been more than ever revenue in gaming, but profit, not so much. It's not so much, not as quick, not for everybody, of course. I mean, Capcom must be profiting because they're remaking their ex Resident Evil game. They should just rename themselves to Remake Com. And just be done with it but you know it made them money why wouldn't they do it why why wouldn't you do the same thing if you have to put in less effort to get more money who wouldn't choose that now it is sad that i'm gonna say kids nowadays go crazy for these games that just don't have the substance you know i don't i can i can turn a blind blind eye to a huge majority of things that I don't like in Resident Evil 2 Remake. Let's let's take that. That's coming soon, so, you know, let's heat it up. I could turn a blind eye to a lot of it, but to a dumbass plot, to paper-thin characters, to characters that are just there to die, just because, oh, this was in the old game, let's put it in the new game, that's not how you do things. But people have clapped, people have been like seals, they've been like, oh, oh, we want more, they gave more. It's like, remember that thing. It's not quite the thing you remember, but looks like the thing. So give us money. And I don't mean the game. I mean like Ben Bertolucci. We'll talk about it when we do a RE2 remake. But <laughs> that's one thing that's been eating me more and more recently. You know, that ne He has never been so wrong as in RE2 remake. Not like... R RE2 original, he's a, he's a key character. He gives our main guys a very key information of the plot yes the police station is you know <laughs> they got their claws into this the, the chief of police no less it's big reveal big info he doesn't just want to give it to you he gives it to you as he's dying <laughs> on his dying breath he was saving it to, to take them down he doesn't trust anyone he's already been betrayed he can't trust leon just like that but then his last uh, 
you know, his last ditch effort is like, I'm dying, there you go, evidence. Please do something worthy with it. In the remake, it's like, hello, human, here's evidence. Oh, my time to die. Blah. And that's it. Done. <laughs> Character serve purpose. It's... I, I, I'm gonna sound like an old man. <laughs> at, at the risk of sounding like an older man, it's unintelligent. It's just... It's not good. You know, it's not... That's why I'm raving about this game, you know, as a sequel, 15 years later sequel. The characters are just, like, real people. I believe... I fucking feel like Ford Crawler exists. Like, he's a real guy. All of these people, but, you know use Ford Crawler because he's very featured and he you get to know him a lot uh, the their their motivations are motivations of real people yes it's fantasy we're going into people's brains but their motivations are you know right there it's this fantasy going into people's brains and playing platforming levels is no less of a fantasy or more of a fantasy than a virus turning humans into undead monsters the difference is just how it's handled you know so that's my monologue that's my i hope my sound wasn't off like forrest gum and i'm gonna end that that's all i have to say about that <laughs> and that's the only thing that's heard i wouldn't mind 80 euro price if the game had full content not broken and the retail version has the whole game on the physical media oh look they they don't like me talking about this i'm getting the <laughs> i'm getting taken down <laughs> The stream has officially been attacked. <laughs> yep, <laughs> there you go. <laughs> I said the same thing, Veil. I, they couldn't take it anymore. The, the cancer man has spoken or like puffed his last puff of smoke and just decided to cut me off. <laughs> See, that's what I'm feeling. You're paying for all this shit. You're, I'm, for months I've been weighing in on paying for Streamlabs Premium. I really do. I have nothing against giving money for a, for a service that works. Like, you know, I need Adobe Creative Cloud for work. I'm a f video editor. It's pricey, but it makes money. It makes sense. If I paid for Adobe Pre a Creative Cloud Premium <laughs> and it didn't make me money, it wasted money, I wouldn't pay for it, would I? Why the fuck would I do that? It would be a very, contra you know, I can't even, like, what words to use? <laughs> it would be counterproductive in every way, but yeah. Normally we should expect more with the price, with price increases, but we are getting less, yeah. Well, like I say, you know, it, $50 now is maybe $30, 1998, let's say. About, it's me from the, the top of my head, but the inflation eats it up. So I get the value and all that. But like you said, charge it 80 bucks. Charge it for fuck's sake, $100. People are complaining Xbox One, was it, or Series X? Some, one of them was $500. It's too much. For a machine, you get the machine with little space people there to make 4,000 column, 4,000 rows of 3,000 something. I forgot what's the 4K resolution exactly. But pixels refresh 120 times every second to bring you the best colors possible for the content you want to watch and five hundred dollars is too much but there we're gonna pay f that's one tenth of a game ten games one console i think that's an excellent ratio and something's wrong with that ratio honestly it shouldn't be like that consoles should be pricier i'm gonna get killed now <laughs> games should be pricier but they should work for fuck's sake they should be done and work i don't want to pay for partial you know it's like bill pays to build get the house built but we built you the stairwell here you go stairwell this is it, we're done. We'll come back next year and add a room. We're, are we going to finish all the rooms? Pfft. Probably not. We're going to make as many rooms as we can before we make... <laughs> before we decide to make something else, like a space condo with AI and colorful peppers, because I guess that's in uh, the year this is happening. I don't know. <laughs> Imagine buying a finished game in 2024, yeah exactly <laughs> all right speaking of finished games let's finish a finished game but yeah do keep do keep chatting guys i do wanna it shouldn't be just be my monologue but since we're there i always i always like ah let's focus on the game you know i'll we'll talk about it some other time then i review my recordings and i think hey i could have talked about this or that why do i keep just jumping myself you know stopping my We'll finish the game. We'll play five more episodes if we have to. The, the point is to hang out, you know, and 
hey, is this if this is the way my voice gets heard, then so be it. What did you say? What is that you say? You could use a better microphone. Yeah, we'll get to that. <laughs> you can't. We can't hear you. Speak up, Sonny. Let's let's never talk about paying 100 for a game. How about <laughs> how about valuing up the money? I think that would be the best solution. Instead of like dollar is getting close to dinar. Not really, but like so. When I was a kid, one dinar, one dollar. I think I thought talked about that. Now that's Serbian dinar, our currency. In case you don't know what the fuck I'm talking about. That was 1996, 1997. Now, $1 is 100 and give or take 5 dinars. That's a huge inflation markup for 30 years, a little less than 30 years. It's crazy, isn't it? So, and it's happening to all the, you know, it's happening gradually. When you know it, when you've been through it, you can see it. A lot of folks, well, a lot of folks see it, but there are some folks, especially, in, you know, in 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 the western world where they have more faith you know in the in the entire thing and they're it's gradual that's all i'm trying to say it's it goes slowly so when you look now in five years you'll see a bigger difference than now and tomorrow right and that's how it works it's not hey <laughs> i saw that somewhere what are you talking about inflation like the packet of meat is the same as it was uh, five months ago yeah it is it's five times smaller but it's still the packet of meat okay, you know you can Indian always com coming. you can I always your back is as red as i remember it hello welcome Lyubka. hello <laughs> you can always change the language to make the lie sound true you know that's always a thing that's like with everything that's 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 uh that keeps working nowadays despite it shouldn't like like Twitch here, which you could talk about that. We already talked talked about like, the kind of, the kind of, <laughs> the kind of re response you get from support. Like, how is this even? <laughs> Are you paid for your work? Are you just like protesting your boss by one, by by giving me the shaft? I don't. Why are we not talking? Why is nobody take take talking about that? Make him stop! Make him stop! <laughs> no, it's my power. But seriously, you know why is like the? It's always you know, it's it's the it's the little thing. You know, it's it's not too much. That's okay. We'll just put it under the carpet. And one day you turn around like I used to have a carpet here, but there's a fucking Mount Everest of garbage behind me now. Where is my carpet? Well, the carpet's gone. It's long been you know elevated by the garbage you put on it under it so it's not a carpet anymore and i think that's happening to society at large you know and how did we get to this we all started with <laughs> you're gonna charge for new game plus you i don't even know like the you know the the insults i want to use are too much i'm aware of that you know i get it i, I don't set the rules i just have to follow them because i'm in someone else's house here you know being on the platform twitch so even if i disagree hey i decided to walk into their house and yeah, i gotta obey their rules that's how it goes but let's just say i would i would like probably go like bleep for the next five minutes if it's true please don't let it be true that we're gonna start paying new game plus as a dlc because there's gotta be a limit man where do you where where do you draw the line what's next the title screen, five dollars. You want to see the intro? Another five dollars. We're gonna get the game segmented. Hey, hey, you want just the story mode? No battles, only cutscenes. For you, twenty-five bucks, my man. Just twenty-five bucks. You want to see a battle from start to finish? It's basically a movie, you know. We're, we'll get to that. Someone will get it. May, hell, maybe I just gave someone an idea. Please don't listen to me when I talk about shit like this. Do not listen. Do not. These, these are things you don't want to try at home in the office in the future or in the past don't <laughs> but seriously let's get into the game bro. fucking before they ch start charging me for the final level no <laughs> hello boundy welcome boundy i was go oh I okay i thought it was bounding gray it would be funny if bounding gray's last name was earth bounding gray <laughs> hello and welcome boundy granny of yore let's start yeah i've been i've been holding a political monologue here for too long well it's not really political but it sounds like i'm having a debate for presidency over my own 
channel versus myself. I can't lose. <laughs> it's a hell of a plan. Mara Hazard. Poo -poo -poo. <laughs> I already forgot it. Yeah. <laughs> People used to complain about arcades being expensive. Yeah, yeah, if you get good enough in the arcades. I know, it's, it's, it's like that with everything. Today's pains will become tomorrow's... Uh, what, what should we call them? I don't know. Tolerances. Let's call them tolerances. Today's pains will become tomorrow's tolerances. And it keeps... You know, it goes like that. Now, in many aspects, that's a good thing, right? But in some aspects, that's not a thing you want to do. That's not a thing you want to just... It's not good. It's not good. Man, am I eloquent or what? <laughs> oh, my guys. Oh, my guys. Bounding gray. How's my brother John doing? My Johnny boy. Hey, just look at my Johnny. <laughs> Yeah, can you put it? Can you can you use it in a sentence, Lubka? Because <laughs> I, for me, it's censored on the Windows uh, emoji panel. It's censored at least in this. I, I, I've noticed something. So I'm wondering. <laughs> I'm wondering. Maybe the emoji panel works. See, there you go. She can use it. Maybe the emoji panel works like automatically censors different emoji based on what, what you, where you're using it. That would that would be. Thing. There it goes, zombie. Copy it quickly before they. Take it away from us. They're gonna break our middle fingers for just going. What if what if my good day to Zombie Chow is hello Zombie Chow? What if what if that's our good good hello goodbye? This is hello and I don't know, this is goodbye. Who's gonna stop us? You know? What's like random la, random George passing by and going, Oh my, my tea holding hand is quivering from disgust. <laughs> Dear God. God, oh shit, I'm summoning too many Georges. <laughs> Alright, Lyubka, see, we, we held off the story before you got here. It's gonna get very emotional, very crazy, and very familiar. He has been working his cute ass off. And he's addicted to Like a Dragon, IW. I wanna? I, I, shit, I've seen what it was, but I forgot. I've seen it, because... It's said on letters, but has days off for his birthday when I was wonderful, wonderful. Well, that's good, man. A man needs some sleep. Plus, his his job is fucking brutal, man. Been there, done that. Well, it more it did, it done me than I did that, but you know it it did me. <laughs> did a number on my back, so I know the pains. He ain't gonna get no sleep. <laughs> ah, hey, you get censored. You wanna get censored here? Is that what you want? <laughs> Showing emotions in my stream? What do you think this is? Life? <laughs> Reality? Pfft. Here, we only talk about good things. Not... Not... <laughs> not oh, what? Is that your Gmail password? One, two, three, four, five, six letters. Could be. You know, senior people use the least amount number of characters so six i think it's allowed <laughs> uh but <laughs> the final fantasy 5 protagonist <laughs> four four is more than enough hey so i read an interesting fact it's one of those you know you know it's from internet metal gear solid 2 could be real could be a complete lie but i read somewhere a couple of years ago that Originally, the credit card pin had six digits, but the inventor's wife couldn't remember uh, all six digits. She had issues remembering six digits, so he was like, you know what, honey, we're going to clip that. Four digits, just for you. And that's why pins have four digits nowadays. Don't know if that's true, but, you know, it's kind of hard to guess, you know, that gives you uh, 1,000 possible combinations. So, a little less if you... So, it would be a little less if you don't want repeating characters all right everybody let's crack that password <laughs> let's get sasha and mia to help but my dad might be gone by the time we get back 
I need to see what's going on inside his mind. I need to go in. No, don't, don't. Grand no, wait. I wanted to talk to everybody first. You're right. Oh. Do. All right. I guess we don't get to talk to everybody. Just talk to Lily. Wait. What? You're not going to make me do this alone, are you? <laughs> Boundy. Hip hip hooray for Boundy. So we missed a couple of... They wouldn't say anything important, I think. They would all be like, what the fuck is going on? Wow. Jeez. Get over yourself, Dad. What the heck? Right. I am Truman. I am Truman. Bear notes in a bit. That ain't right. Here are his outfits. That's pretty normal. In his mind? Have you ever seen my father? He never thought about his clothes. What the? Maybe your dad was considering a change of beard? Never! Not my dad! Weird. Very weird. Why would he need, like, to remind himself that his he? Huh? Huh? But... Huh? Neon Abyss. <laughs> Why would he... So Lily is suspicious that that's her dad at all. He did act very weird. Well, at least you know he thought about his family. Yeah. But what's with all the lines showing how we're all related? Maybe he was getting more forgetful? Strange. I love the Psychonauts. Lily is your daughter. Oh, look, the cat. Come back, kitty. Oh, it'll come back. Uh. Come on. I've seen you, kitty. Come, come, come. Come on, kitty. Come on, kitty. Yes, my son. Oh, that's a mouse? There, yeah, that one was enough to render. That wasn't a cat, that was a mouse? I, I'm pretty sure I saw a cat there. Oh, wait, there's another purple... cap? Oh, this music. Oh, Sasha, is it... Is it... Get it. <laughs> Are you feeling it? I guess he's really proud of his diplomas. Then why doesn't he hang them up in his office? He's secretly proud? <sighs> she why knows her dad. She knows something's wrong. It's almost like he comes here to practice being himself. Rasputin, I gotta tell you, I don't like it. I like Lily. Weird. It is weird, Lily Meister. Let's crack that dad's noggin and get in. I don't really think of your dad as a vain man. He's not! I'm telling you, something's not right in this stupid place! Hmm. Mm -hmm. Hiya! This statue. Careful, Raz. That's still my dad. Lily, take it from me. All dads are weird. I just don't know what's wrong with him. What the? Here we go. There's something under here. Yeah, more plaster. I'm doing it slowly so we would. One more comment? No. Haha! Whoa, Lily. Your dad was a really big fan of Nick from the mailroom. Well, most people are. Except my dad. My dad once told me he thought Nick John Smith was an obsequious little lick spittle. Lick spittle? That's how my dad talked. My real dad. Raz, this isn't my dad's mind. Lily! Here we go. Settle up. Hey, you kids. Get off that carpet. VIPs only. If it's not your dad's mind, whose mind is it? His. That, that beer belly. <laughs> Nick's brain is missing, 
But, I mean... Nick? Make way, common folk. Make room for Zazarevich Crystal Malik, future Tsar of Grolovia. Tsar. Aha! I didn't see this coming the first time. I was like, what the fuck? Nick from the mailroom is actually. Is the Zazarevich? I can't believe it. What's a Zazarevich? <laughs> the missing heir to the throne of Grulovia. He lived in exile with his family after Maligna destroyed the capital. Why is his brain in your dad's body? And where is my father's real brain? Come on, let's make him talk. Middle Lord, fingers all around. Getting away. Coming through old kids today. Hmm. Excuse me. Hey, no cut. The figments talk. Huh. Move aside. Why is she not Official collecting figments? Business. Pardon us. Help! This person's cutting in line. That's a lot of figments. All right, here we are. Hi. Can we get on the ride, please? Did you two cut in line? We're VIPs. Oh, does that stand for vertically impaired preteens? <laughs> 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 It's for your own safety. Come back when you're older. No time for that, dude. All right, we gotta break the illusion. How about now? When I said come back when you're older, I meant more than a minute older. How about now? When I said come okay. back when you're older, no more. I meant more than a minute older. Oh wait, there's there are figments there. Jeez, I, I almost missed them. They're candles. Is that supposed to mean something? Oh shit! No gravity is. Gravity, I ain't your bitch. So, okay, the the place is trippy. I get that. How do I kickstart the level? I forgot. I remember the ride. I don't remember the start of the ride. Boop. Maybe just fucking break Nick's statue. Hiya. Aha. Ta da. Okay, we're older. Check us now. Oh man, how long have I had this job? <laughs> get out of here. Uh, all right, that's that's yeah, that was so easy. It was stupid. <laughs> Just break one leg. Sorry, Grolovians only. Aha! Uh -huh. You can't. It's okay, Raz. Go, Lily. We finally worry. got in. I have a plan. <laughs> Oh, she's adorable. She's like she's my probably now. Hey. Follow that czar. That's right. Woo! I she's like I like her as much as Elizabeth from Bioshock Infinite. So much personality. Here we go. <sighs> Here comes the fucked up part. Damn, it's fucked up. To the happy day when Crystal Malik would legally and rightfully inherit his father's throne. But alas, that was not meant to be. The Tsar's minister of war and protector of the people, General Maligula, had aroused the jealousy of the warmongering Ford Cruller. 
What the? He led his mob of psychonauts to gang up on Maligula, drowning the brave warrior. Just when I thought I heard every version of this. <laughs> and drowning much of Grulovia in the process. Why didn't the Tsar help Maligula in her time of need? No one knows, but historians agree it is Tsar Theodore's biggest failure. Look at that crown. Intent, Grulovia, the Malix, and Maligula were betrayed by the weakness of the Tsar and the bloodlust of the Psychonauts. Oof. Is some messed up junk. The, the song doesn't make it easier at all. Uh, in fact, it makes it a thousand times harder. Oh, you can turn the camera. Do I really want to? Like, they're, they're, they're happy like in a horror movie. Oh, fuck. They're dancing in water. I just got that. They're drowning here. So this is the deluge of Grulovia. Hey, Raz. People's... I'm watching you on the control panel here. Why'd you stop? This door won't open. What happened to the ride operator? He, uh, had an accident. Hmm. Looks like there's an electrical problem up above the ride. Okay. I'll drain the water so you can get up there. If you can fix it, I should be able to get the ride going again from here. Check. This is inside the guy's mind. So out we go. So there, there was the, there was a, yeah, it's much worse. I thought it would be easier now that we know what's going on, but my God, it's horrible. So that was the, that was inside. The, I'm gonna talk about it and try to explain as we go. So. The guy in, in Truman Zanotto's body, the brain inside Truman Zanotto's body is the brain of the little Tsar, as you heard, Tsarevich. <laughs> the way they, they spell it, though, with G. But yeah, the prince, let's say, in plain English. <laughs> and so this is his version of events. This is in his mind how he sees it happened. It's not like, so it's not like Maligula snapped and Psychonauts came to subdue her peacefully in his mind his father failed his hero Maligula and uh, left her to the warmongering Ford Crawler and the Psychonauts to dr be drowned it's a very warped version of what happened he was a child when it was all going on so Oof, let's go up there I think oh is that a that's either a figment or a nugget up there. At, at the same time, I want them to stop singing, but I also don't. You know what I mean? It's very powerful. So where? Over there? We gotta find a, a way behind. Oh, there you go. Half a mine. Does this go anywhere? No. Can we go back? I think we'll just... Yep, I'd end up in nothing. <laughs> Fucked up. Alright. Somewhere has got to be... Can you help me? Construct? Aha, uh -huh, I think I see it. Up there. Is it this? Yep. Oh wait, there's more figments. Let's look around. Aha, there's... Okay. No, not that. Wrong power. I want this. There they are. The Tsar family. Oh, look, the clouds are pigments. I can tell that a lot of stuff they uh, learned with Glorious Theater they applied in uh, in Psychonauts 2. Oh, Mouse. Hat box tag. Anything with the angels? These are all brains. Look at that. It's like brain mass all around.
gotta get those two. Whoop, no. No, no, not that way. It's doing this, 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 the other thing. I'm, I'm too old, I can't see. What can I tell you? No. Nope. I did it fine before. Probably jumping on the wrong one. Where did they go originally? Yeah, you gotta go step by step, that's why. So anything else up here? Nope. That's a clear nope. He's gone, huh? Couldn't help me, my, uh... My, uh... What do they call them? Archetype? I wanna say pigment. You know, an another thing is eating me. It's hard to say what comes first, but I wanna see what's in here. Yeah. We gotta find these, that's right. I think there's something, yeah, originally there was an achievement when you destroy three of these. Yep. <laughs> I hear you, man. Ah, yeah, you can do that. So it stops being creepy. That's what it, that's for. Oh, dark thoughts. All right. We're sorting his emotional baggage, by the way. See how everything is disconnected in his mind? It's not one solid route through, it's more like a a mashup of memories. And that like Grulovian style. It's not like it's not Eastern Europe at all. <laughs> okay, now it's it's even sadder without the music, honestly. I shouldn't have killed the music. Kill the music only after <laughs> you're done with the section. Yeah, this would have been creepier with the music. This is not how I heard this story. Then again, I'm not sure who to trust anymore. Hey, Ford, think you can help me up into those rafters? I'm I'm curious. Mm, was it before or after? Yeah, that was after I killed the music a minute and a half. Too bad. It's so weird. The whole level is just. Oh, there they are running. I remember there was shit in here as well. I think I hear something. All right, at least something positive. Five, huh? All right, that's the last thing. That's the last thing before we get to Limitless. And we're rank 92, so 10 ranks now left. And look, there's shit up there. I don't know if it's worth anything. As in, If I need it for anything. So weirdly quiet. <laughs> I can hear all the props. So I need Ford's help. How? Aha! To get up there. Anything down that I missed? I don't think so. Well, we'll be back here. Because we can't... Like I said, you can't 100% the second game before the ending do i want to slow it down is that what i want to do i mean that would be silly but i'm gonna try it nevertheless do, 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 do. Mm, i'm gonna need my mental connection why can't I... Let me climb you, Ford. Alright, maybe I'm doing it wrong. Should I do it on my... Uh, tele... Uh, not... Levitation? Yep. 
You think I'm supposed? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Well, let me see. It's not there. It's gotta be. But you can't stand on him. He said, Ford, can you help me climb that? But I don't see I can stand on him. Maybe I'm just supposed to bounce off of him, huh? Or, or, like that. Just follow the figments. Angels. They make whoop, everything's squeaking. Oh yeah, I haven't played it really like this. First time I played it with music. <laughs> All through. It's like the... Like the phantom of the theater in the first game. <laughs> Catwalks and whatnot. Problem? Looks good, Raz. Get back on the ride and I'll start it up again. Alright, let's get in there. Wait, where was my ride? Oh, it was right there. We don't need help? I think I got everything else here. Oops. Are we done? You sure, Lily? Oh, they have Shubara heads. I don't know what you call Shubara in English. Russian winter heads? Okay. Do we have sensory overload? We do, actually. Big time. What's big time? Oh, big time. Okay. We want more side blast. Chain gain instead of big time. There you go. For them, I just like to shoot, you know, if I don't have to, like that, uh, come close. He died a tragic death by ending his life. Mental Blast for the win, look at that, fully upgraded Mental Blast. Hapwa! All right, she's gonna be an enabler, isn't it? Let's say now I'm gonna have to mix it up. Add this to the mix and put some grenades in there. No good. No good. I need the enabler. Making it impossible to do any damage. Yep. Oof. I know, I know, I'm trying to dodge his way, Raz, I'm stuck, Jesus Christ, we're in the same, I slowed the wrong guy, he's, oh my god, he's protecting the, the sensor, wrong power, it's false positivity, look how good it he is at dodging, Dude, did you just crank up the difficulty, little shit? No good. They're under that enabler's protection. No fire will stop them. Yeah, fire, that stops them, that's right. There you go. <laughs> Multi-death. So with the final upgrade, they should burn and then blow up like that one. Zip -a -bop -a -bop. Oh, 
Please don't. No, wait. <sighs> Relax. I know what I'm doing. Now? Will you just get back on the dumb ride? God, they were made for each other. <laughs> Let's leave it at that, like that for now. What did I use? Big time, huh? Get me out of Gulovia. Hang on. And the song continues. So, I, like I said, you, you don't kill it forever. It just keeps on being creepy. Avenge Maligula. God, I forgot that part, yep. Doubt they went that far on foot. Endless ocean. They lived in the ocean. <laughs> yeah. For the glory of Grilovia, or whatever. What's the holdup? Hang on, I gotta talk to a guy about a door. <laughs> uh, excuse me, but this door over here. Sorry, busy. Busy, busy with what? Propaganda nearing. I'm creating a future chapter in this glorious, semi interactive location based epic. This treasure room tells the story of how once the Zazarovich finds Maligula and restores Grulovia to its former glory, the people will all share in unimaginable riches. But it's missing something. Not sure what. Like something to go in that big egg cup in the middle? Yeah, something there. <laughs> like maybe an egg? That's it! See, sometimes you just need a fresh set of eyes. Hey. You get me a big, beautiful, luxurious egg, and I'll use my pass to open that door for you. Deal! Hey, where do they keep the big eggs around here? Crystal told me the best eggs he ever found were out in the ocean. Whatever that means. Put the egg in the basket. Remember Lobato in the first level? He had the whole mnemonic. Put the egg in the basket, the basket in the sea, the fucking, I don't know, murder children and... Yep dance around he didn't say that but he might as well have yeah it's gonna make sense case gotcha. so we gotta oh wait there's a whole section jeez where did it come from where this where's the guy guy come back dude <gasps> I, I'm already lost. What if I fall? Will I die? I don't want to try. Egg dude. Where's the egg dude? He was here. We just talked. What the? Oops. They're not going to like that. All right. Never mind. It's not real anyway. There she is. Loose. Poor Loose. 
I'll bet my little flat friend could get in there. Is that where the... Yep. I'm not gonna kill the music this time, as much as it hurts me. <laughs> as in mentally, I think it's good for the background. Concerning, but good. There's the guy. Alright, that's the egg guy. That's where the eggs go. Is that a nugget? So his nuggets are eggs, huh? There's the death What's that sound? Uh huh, there's a there it is, a purse. Do we have a purse tag? I need the purse tag here. <laughs> Dying Zar Why why are there crowns <laughs> why are there crowns chandeliers? That's the part. Is that like the child's imagination part? Or what's the purpose of that? We have this thing. Like in the first name, first name, like in the first game, Peter McConnell nailed this soundtrack. Just perfect. All right, we do want my uh, projection archetype. Thank you for the help. That's where the music is. Yep. So I'll do that last then. I wonder if there's. Woohoo! Don't break it yet. So there are three parts and three of these, right? I think. Oh, no! Ship! Alright, we'll go back. But that, that, that went backwards very fast. Alright. Oh, it's the architect. He can go in there with me. So let's just remember to kill the music before we leave the section, huh? Because I need the egg, and after I get the egg, I can give it to the guy, and then we can go on. So I shouldn't be able to move on before, you know, doing that. Now, this part is also a little surreal. This is totally glorious theater. Something with the fire? Maybe I should use some fire here. Send my guy outside. You wait there, dude. Right, that's not what I wanted to do, but... Okay, no fire here, I guess. I thought maybe you gotta summon a fire for it to start the fire. There's another. First tag. There we go. Doesn't that mean I missed one baggage at the start? In the first section? Because we found the tag, but not the bag. And we've seen the purse behind the bed, that's right. You know, I play horror games a lot. I love psychological horror. I love games like Silent Hill. But this, man, this just gives me such an uneasy feeling. Maybe it's the composition. Maybe it's the, the whole situation, you know. Whatever it is, it's brilliant. And, you know, I love it. But it's also very uneasy. Lily, do you see any controls for a giant painted mural with props? I see something called Glovian Diasporama. Diasporama. Buttons for scenery, props, and heroes. Oh, Diasporama. That's... <laughs> well, <laughs> that's pretty good. 
So okay, let's start with the scenery. Let's change the scenery. Okay, there are buttons for Arctic Exile, Adrift at Sea, and Desert Wasteland. Let's start with you. Desert Wasteland. What's this all about? I think I want to change something else now. Whatever. Okay, that's enough for now. Thanks, Louis. Let's see. I want to see if there's anything in there. Can you enter these? Yeah, you should be able. But you gotta, yeah, you gotta line them up. Oh, yeah, I see. Lily, can you change that projector screen again? Sure. It has buttons for scene. Let's, Let's go back. The scenery. Oh. What the hell? I think I did it. I think I got the oof, the perfect timing. <laughs> so Arctic has a. Uh... Arctic exile, please. Is this going to help me find my dad's brain? I think I want to change something else now. Whatever. Can we alter the props? Yep. You want cacti, fish, maybe some trees? What about the goat frozen there? Fish, no. I want to change something else, I think. Figures. Could you move the family for me? Sure. Where do you want them? Stage left, right, or center? Hmm. About okay, that family. I don't think about that family anymore. Me either. Let's try the Let's scenery. Let's change the scenery. Okay. There are buttons for Arctic Exile, Adrift at Sea, and Desert Wasteland. Let's start with Desert, all right? And we'll just move desert them in the props. Wasteland. I was just thinking the same thing. There is something in there, okay? I think I want to change something else now. Whatever. Whatever. <laughs> Can we alter the props? Yep. You want cacti, fish, maybe some trees? Cacti, I or... think some cacti would really set the mood. Interesting toy. Those trees are ruining it. Get rid of them. I guess. I want to change something else, I think. Figures. Hmm. Family. Could you move the family for me? Sure. Where do you want them? Stage left, right, or center? Front, Front and, center. and center. I think that's where Crystal would like his family. Is this going to help me find my dad's brain? Okay, I don't want to think about that family anymore. Me either. Okay, that's enough for now. Thanks, Lily. She's standing, so she's just waiting there while I'm trying to help her dad. Can I climb up there? Am I supposed to climb up there? Maybe I'm like get some fish or another tree, maybe. Okay, can you climb there, Raz? Hmm. Up. All right. What's the what's the deal with climbing there? I wonder. You can't climb here because you just fall out. You can't stand on that narrow. Hmm. Let me try. Wapata. Nope. It's just like a wall. If he's doing that, he sees it as a wall. What if I just jump? Nope. Maybe it's one of the other props, huh? Like it almost seems like something else should be here to help me climb. Let's try the props. What about the fish? It's Lily, like... can you change that? It has buttons for scene. Well, fuck it. Maybe the family needs to be to the left so I can climb them. Could you move the family for me? Sure. Where do you want them? 
Let's put the family stage left. What's this all about? Okay, I don't want to think about that family. Me either. Okay, that's enough for now. Thank Bye, Roz. <laughs> no, that doesn't help. Definitely, that definitely does not help. Not even his hat. So leave the family. Try something else. Family on the right. Can you change that projector screen again? No, love, please. I'm trying not to think about it. It has buttons for. Well, let's alter, alter the props. The props? I think what this needs is some. I was just thinking the same thing. Would that help? And then add the trees. Fuck it. Put everything there. Change something else. Let's see. Figures. Okay, that's enough for now. Thanks, Lily. Bye, Roz. Wait, is that cactus? No, it's the same cactus. There we go. So it is the fish. The unlikely. What's in here? Half a mine. That's supposed to be like, oh yeah, they're, they're cooking. So they were in the, on the American frontier apparently. Projector screen again? Sure. Let's see the ocean. It has buttons for scenery, props, and heroes. Let's, Let's change, change the scenery. The scenery. <laughs> okay. There are buttons for Arctic exile, adrift at sea, and desert wasteland. Show me a drift at sea, could you? I guess. I think I want to change something else now. Whatever. Whatever. <laughs> Can we alter the props? Yep. You want cacti? Fish? Maybe some trees? Hmm. The trees are ruining Those trees are ruining it. Get rid of them. Are you sure this is doing something? Hello and welcome, Carter. Welcome to the stream. It is I, Roderick Carter, having returned from my... Wait, really? Was it your, is it really your birthday? Returned from my birthday. Like from the birthday party? What was I doing? Cactus. Mm, the fish. I want the fish. I want to change something else, I think. Figures. Uh, move the, f maybe now Could to the middle? you move the family for me? Sure. Where do you want them? Stage left, right, or center? 27th, that's like, well, in a week, two big things I learned about you. Huh, yeah, yeah, another secret reel. There you go. Wow, Carter. Wow, so much in so little time, really. Well, happy birthday. Happy birthday, Carter. I hope you spent it well with, you know, loved ones. And hope the cake was good. Can't have, you know, cake's got to be there. Got to be a good cake. How are you? We're here near the end. You know already the story, but man, like this song just keeps repeating. <laughs> it's not making it easy. Fishing? Fishing. Because you saw fish here. That's why you wrote fishing. <laughs> Front and center. I think that's where Crystal would like his family. Mmm, nice. That's, you know... At this age, the best I can, the best thing. More, 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 more and more, I think it's very. The best birthdays are with family, you know, with the closest ones. Doesn't matter, you know, big party, small party, as long as they're here, there, all of them. Fellow Aquarius, fishing for birthday wishes. 
<laughs> yeah, <laughs> fishing coco. Okay, I get it. Yeah, that's a that's an interesting expression. Fishing. Look, that guy's fishing for compliments. <laughs> No, this this track is now breaking my brain, but you should, we should be going. It is the age of Aquarius, but without Grulovia, please. I can't I can't take this out. We need a little uh, brainwashing here. Okay, I don't want to think about that family anymore. Me either. Okay, that's enough for now. Let's Thanks. see what we got here. Bye, the brain uh, wall behind is really worrying me. Yeah, am I, I am supposed to use them as platforms. I knew it. I knew it. The moment I set my eyes on that fish, I knew it. Hey, I know where I am. This is the Lady Lucktopus. That's the right. Alex must have lived at the casino for a while, suffering in exile. Ha! And the music just dies. Everything goes into Lady Lucktopus mode. Yeah, remember eggs? He wants more eggs. That's the that's the bathroom, man. Everything's the same. It's, tr it's as trippy as a Silent Hill. <laughs> I don't know. I just man, I don't know. Ask the writers of here. <laughs> Lily, there's a room here just like the one we found on the mission to the casino. The delusionist was Crystal. So that's why Nick had a octopus key in his pocket. Yep. He was yeah, in exile. <laughs> Ooh, that means he's the one who wrote the creepy note about me. He's here, Crystal. Really? Wait a second. Huh. So we're gonna go from the place of understanding as usual. Where's my water bottle? <laughs> that took me five seconds. You fucker. <laughs> Did he shit his pants or is that... Is that caviar? Do I want to talk to him even? Uh, him and his chandelier of a crown with... Wow, those are luxurious rubies you got from a Resident Evil place. Do I want to talk to him first, I guess? Hey! <laughs> Why the long face? My father died today. Oh, oh, God. I'm sorry. Don't be. He ruined my life. And if it weren't for him, I'd be the Tsar of Grulovia. <laughs> Believe it or not. Instead, I'm homeless. Displaced <laughs> anger. This place looks pretty nice. Ha. Good one. Hey, kid. There's something about you I like. He doesn't get by any chance of Grulovian blood. Ah, uh, that's a creep person. I am. I knew it. <laughs> Come and let us toast to the fatherland. Hey, want some caviar? I don't know. I've never had caviar. That's okay. It's just eggs. Incredibly expensive eggs. Well, since you put it that way... You won't regret it. I mean, look at these eggs. Ugh, it's like a dog Maybe I'll have just one. <laughs> I don't think one is gonna do the trick. We'll see. Oh, God, it's trippy. It's beautiful. Wait, but I didn't get the figments. Ah, oh, shit. If it turns out I should have taken the figments first, I think we'll be able to go back in there. God, game. Be more creepy. Look at the photos. Look at everything around. He's rolling his egg on, on, on the red carpet. Don't fall, egg. Not gonna lie, it was hard for me to start this today. I knew what was gonna happen and 
Oof, it's one of the... One of the sadder... Oh, no, no, no. Okay, we'll do it again. Need some leeway. <laughs> yeah. So there's they're, they're knives, actually. All right. There we go. Okay, 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 you can do it, you can do it, you can do it. Nope, okay. That was close. You gotta start ahead of time because everything has its like physics, like real physics, everything has momentum. And <laughs> it's kind of hard to keep it steady. Woo! Just. No! God, that was so. So close. <laughs> oh, okay, just balance. It's like me balancing on the egg right now. Stop with the... You can't give me momentum in a physics-based game. Wait, yeah, that's exactly what you should do in a physics-based game. Oh, God, I just wanted an egg. Is it too much to ask for? Nope. Too, too, too late. God, so, so close. All right, at least it's got checkpoints mental checkpoints no fuck it Woo -hoo 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 -hoo. Woo. come on oh jeez no i shouldn't have went god just gotta be patient all right <laughs> he doesn't want to end it oh whoop Okay, so just work with the momentum wherever it's going. No, stop. And one more. Okay, the two fans just gotta be very... Oh, did both of them. No, why would you get stuck there? Oh god, I can't believe that worked. <laughs> I did two of them at once, that was not the idea. No time to look at the photos, we gotta roll the egg. Oh, jeez. Oh my god! Quick! Roll that over to the treasure room before anyone sees what you did! Oh, my poor Theodore! Alright, I can still do it. How do I stop rolling? Can I stop rolling? No, fuck, I'm stuck on it. I should have checked the room first. It's That's the thing, you don't... Well, you can't 100% it before finishing anyway, so... It's not gonna... <laughs> it's not gonna do much. It's that's just... Right, right through here. I don't like when I don't know what's gonna start, kickstart the next thing. Unless I'm in an RPG, you know? Perfect! Now please leave before you break anything else. I don't wanna end yet. Please don't make me... Okay. Good, thank you, game. We got the egg in there. One of them was a nugget, and that's it. The brain, the brain wall is still there. Gloria, Gloria, you creepy fucking shit. Hey, before we leave, we gotta kill the music, yeah. I didn't want to do it. Imagine it was silent this whole time. Oh, he's gone from here. All right. The book. Delusionist. Okay, so that's their manifesto, I guess. That's a giant eggplant. Offended! I think it's a, a, an eggplant. I don't know. We just talked about eggplants. I'm gonna burn this hotel a little. Hiya! What's the worst that can happen? That's him eating caviar. Caviar? Cuviar? Ew, stinky. So he's living like a pig, basically, with lots of caviar. Oh, wow. There's a hot dog on the toilet. Not, no matter how much hungry I am. Oh, God. Who lives like this, especially in someone else's room? Ew. Fuck the cans. Uh, 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 
the fact that everything is a stage makes it even more unsettling, honestly. Yep. There's nothing else here. Let's go back to the Grulovian hymn. Alright, let's kill the music. No, why? Why don't I look? I'm like, ah, things will just work out on their own. Okay, now I did not I did not see that one coming. Not gonna lie, that one was that one got me off guard. <laughs> you think this is better, Raz? Like this creepy silence is better? Alright, you can do it a little early, but hasty, it's like It's like I can't wait to get to the end of this level. You act guy, you good? Oops. <laughs> Can I talk to you? No? Alright. I guess I after you slow him down you can't talk to him anymore. <laughs> Here we go. This is Ready to roll. Finally! Part three. Sure, I mean, I'm I'm like 95% sure, nobody told me, but they all, all the names are references to something. Look, he's got the titanium tied to his back. There's Bobby Zilch. <laughs> he saw them all. Undaunted, Crystal Malik dove straight into the belly of the beast itself, infiltrating the psychonauts in their filthy lair. That was his life, the, the only thing he had to bring back Maligula, who was his hero, a childhood hero. Now, love? Now? <laughs> All I hear is Grulovia now. It's appropriate, isn't it? <laughs> Grulovia, Grulovia, you creep the shit out of me. Grulovia, Grulovia, let me check this door. Oh, it's not a door. Oh. Wait, why do they look like... Oh shit, it's Grulovians. Ah! Need new powers. Alright, time to swap. Uh, you're gonna need a pin. Gonna need my buddy here. 
You start... Get him, buddy. Why is he not doing shit? Alright. Guess I'll have to do everything. Woo! He's gonna blow them apart. So I'm gonna take this. Throw one my way. Come on. I dare you. I double dare you. Oh boy, panic attacks, panic attacks. Uh, I'm gonna say this. Is, I mean, panic attacks, panic attack. Uh, I slowed down the wrong thing, but I still have. What do I have? I need the thing that explodes like a grenade when burned alive. Cooked alive! No enabler can help you, boy. You just destroy them all. Oh, my archetype is really having a blast over there. Two on one. Two on one. <laughs> Burn, Stooley, burn! How dare you kill my archetype? Really, how dare you? How fucking dare you? Oh, I love that they can hurt each other. That is wonderful! Just wonderful! Slappity slap slap! In slow mo. Take some slaps for me, please. Ow! That's not the dodge button. Doofer! Oh, Jesus Christ, you're annoying. Go on, die, you should have one sliver of health left. Hiya! Oh shit, alright. Ooh. What should I do with you, my. Woohoo! Oh yeah, punch each other. Oh. <laughs> you don't need a hammer. Hammers are overrated. Oh, that was pretty good. <laughs> Love making them fight each other. Come on, archetype, do something. I gotta order it, I guess. Oh, I thought he was gonna hit the other guy. Dodge. Always dodge before hitting. See, or you get bitch slapped, like literally. <laughs> oh yeah, I need my... Grabby thing. Yeah, back to cra creep, creep, crappiness, creepiness. Okay, I do I want to find that cart and get back on the ride again? You need this more than me. I sure do, buddy. La la la, we're creepy fox. We're gonna creep you up. La 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 la. We'll be in your dreams tonight. Gloria, Gloria, we're your nightmares as of now. Gloria, oh, it's done. So there's music here. There's no music on the other hand. La 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 la. It's like it's like uh, not the media. It's like uh, the Stockholm syndrome. The the more I listen to it, the more I want it. 
I ain't gonna need you for a while, buddy. Everything is fucked up. Dr. Caligosto Lobato? <laughs> I'm glad you like my show, buddy. The nightmares will stay with me. Where do I want to go first? That looks like an exit, I, I dare say. So I'm gonna check here. Probably in the back of the mind are some hidden... Thought. Yep. Emotional baggage. Wait, I thought we had that, huh? We didn't have the steamer trunk tag. Wouldn't go down if I were me. Alright, we gotta find the steamer trunk tag. I gotta become the baggage expert here. What is that? That's just some Rulovian bouncer, I guess. Gulovia, Gulovia. I'll forever be terrified of communist songs. Uh, this button? Yep. Oh shit, everything's... I wanna go back! No, I wanna go back! How did I get here? I went that way, that way, that way. Jeez, every th where's the gravity? Where's up? There's Lobato. But there's still no tag. You know what? There. Yep, there's a figment there. How did I not see that? You gotta be very... Uh, patient with it. Alright, I'll be able to get this one as well. Hiya! See? Where they're hiding? In the blades of the fan. Or whatever that is. So are we absolutely sure that this place where no dimension is at the right one doesn't hold... What is that up there? I don't trust anything in levels like this. Up is down, down is up, and my name is Lucy. Oh. Where's the... Alright, so no steamer trunk tag, I guess. We'll find out when I do the collectibles. Fuck it, let's just move on. Waka! Hiya! Here we go. Well, you'd think that's Lobato taking uh, Gristle's brain, right? This must be the moment where Lobato stole Agent Zanato's brain. Creepy. What are we gonna use? So Crystal Malik was the one who hired you to swap his brain in for Truman's? I'll never tell. I'm literally watching you do it right now. Where did you put Truman's brain? I'll, I'll never tell. tell. Come Egg on. in the basket. I'll That's never tell. <laughs> the yeah. There we go. Egg basket. Old egg box. That's how it went. Put the egg in the basket, put the old egg in the box, and I think the box goes into the sea or something like that. That's what he kept saying over and over when we caught him in the first level. Ugh. I hear something familiar. There it is. That's what I'm looking for. Here's the steamer trunk tag. So that tells me, unless the last bag is somewhere God knows where, well, I have two tags, three tags with no bags. So I know where the bags are now. Shit, I should... I gotta go back there? No, where? That's where the steam... Can I just jump down there? I'm gonna try it. What's the worst that's gonna happen? Journey ball! Oh, didn't even give me a chance. You know what? If that didn't work the first time, second time it's gonna work. Geronimo! Nope. Alright, I guess you gotta obey the laws of the game. 
Gulovia, Gulovia. I just want to sort your emotional baggage and I don't have enough syllables to put it all in one rhyme. So I'm going the church way. The false rhyme way. What's with the fan down here? Oh no! What's with the fan down there? That's what I want to know. Nope! Don't rush. Just don't fucking rush. That one's good. Nope. That one's good. Nope. Never touch the floor. We're going doing the don't touch the floor challenge. You just jump, jump, glide. Uh. What's with the why the fan there if it does nothing? Have I forgotten something? Missed something? The presentation of these levels is just magnificent. I've heard a very weird, I think that was the tag, that boing 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 sound. Raz, where'd you go? I found some weird stuff off the ride and... Raz, we're chasing Crystal Malik, remember? Not having fun at an amusement park. I'm headed back to the cart now. So, he literally found Ford, a broken man. Like the song says, that part is true. And, uh... This was a Whispering Rock, right? He realized... Well, he realized. He has his own version of events, right? That's the Titanium tied to Ford's back so he wouldn't snap completely. Literally keeping him together. He told us in the first game we didn't trust him. And... He thinks it's because he feels remorse for his actions. Which, in a way, is true. There are the campers. Bobby Zilch. Dogen Bull. What was the, his name? Uh, Mikhail, the Russian bear. The two suicide kids that creeped me out the last time we played. That was probably the scariest part of the first game. Yep. Oh look, even like, everything is in Psychonauts 1 graphics. Look, 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 look. I forget that. Look how weird it gets. Or am I just like losing it? Yeah, this is definitely... Look. Oops. Did I want to do that? Oh. That's the save room from the first game, basically. The... It's locked. Uh huh, it's locked. It's locked. Yeah, they did it on purpose. Look, even the... See how it changes, how it works? Look at the colors here. Look at the colors now. It goes back to PS2. <laughs> Xbox original. The... the what do you call it? The proportions are also different, like in the first game. Excellent. So he saw the campers, obviously. He's been, Gristle has been in the thing. Is this the way back to the ride? Oh, memory vault. Here we go. Whispering Rocks Psychic Summer Camp. A land without caviar. Blah, blah, blah. Problems. I'm dumb. That's how a child sees it. So, uh, so that's, so the protests in Grulovia where they were begging the Tsar to, you know, help the people. The young Gristle was eating cavi caviar and all he saw was just people doing blah, blah. And, when Maligula drowned them, he saw that like as a legit turning off the problem. While that's happening, the Tsar is like, holy shit, we're fucked. He's sweating, but the kid's still eating caviar. That's little Gristle there. Nick the mailman. The butcher's like, uh, he looks like from Disenchantment, uh, voiced by Noel Fielding. If you've watched Disenchantment, you know the, the butcher. I meant the, he's not the butcher. He is basically, but he's like, not the Undertaker, the other guy, the guy who kills people. The Executioner, yeah. The Executioner, <laughs> Butcher, Undertaker. Uh, <laughs> nope. <laughs> yeah, the Executioner is pretty, uh, pretty 
How do I put that? <laughs> He's good with his uh, with his job. Like, yeah, but he reminds me of the disenchantment executioner. <laughs> Fury in the slaughterhouse. What is that? Is that is that a movie from the seventies? Oh, the executioner ended up dead. Well, well, when the czar went for a swim with his chandelier on the head, and they were like, "Get the fuck out of here!" This is all rooted in real stories, you know. Real, of course. With anyone had elementary history, so you know these stories. <laughs> so they went to a hotel. All he had was caviar. Oh, no more caviar. He ate it all. He ruled this foreign land rude more like curse this foreign land without caviar what the shit that's his locked up memory oh okay i didn't know that do i want to go here really or is it the other end of the yeah that's the other end that's where it was locked it was locked because it's only open from the from one side. So both cabins in his mind are actually connected. Is there anything behind the other cabin though before we move? So my whole 40 minute speech from the start of this stream, I think it was 40 minutes, it was something like it was a long speech. But you know, it's about things like these. So this this amazing and well thought out game compared to something else that came out at the same time for the same price and was unfinished. Quite a few of them actually. This is where we got out of, right? Yeah? Yep. I see more fragments on the house. Just the physics goes weird here. Okay, there you go. It's like... Stop bugging me. The birds figments? How the fuck am I supposed to get that? How am I supposed to go up there? Maybe like this? That's the main lodge. Okay, that's the main lodge I came out of. I should recognize the areas from the first game, really. Can I climb up, up? No, don't fall. From, just climb, yeah? There you go. Alright, birds. Don't fuck with me, birds. Birds! Oh, j oh it counts, okay. We'll get more birds. Oh, wait. Dumb me. I was afraid to burn Crawler, but that's how you do it. I wonder if they wanted that mechanic in the first game, but didn't have the time to implement it. The, you know, campfire wind mechanic. Because it would make so much sense in the camp. Oh, look, that's the cougar I used to fight. Where's the Russian bear? Oh, I mean, the wrestling bear. Yo, bear, come bear. Mikhail has something to say to you, bear. No, Mikhail, we ate Mikhail. The squirrels, they're all liars. Do I dare go in there? Maybe that's where I'm supposed to go? Is it this where I'm supposed to go? Oh, this is where the ride went. That's why it's so weird. I see, I see. Is that where the... Yeah, that's where the music is. Alright. We're about to kill it then, before we proceed. Shit. Uh, really? Kind of sad, but also a little relieving. It's, it's the third one. So originally, you know, the first time you play this, there's an achievement to destroy all three phonographs. And that's it, right? Yeah, we're just going down. I remember this part. And back in the ride. Get me out of this creepy place. Okay. Oh no, we're the more figments. Oh fuck. Keep a lookout for it. <laughs> That's really something. The moment I started I saw figments. I should have looked around. Yeah, it doesn't it?
I love his out of tune singing. code name I made for you. Oh, I like it. Let's go mash crystal. Egg beater and potato masher. All right. Man, beetles, beetles in their most drugged out time have nothing on this shit. <laughs> animated. This is all in engine. Just beautiful. Amazing. Just amazing. Gift shoppy. <laughs> yeah, I... Whatever. Whatever else. <laughs> Oh, that's me. Look, that's me in there. Hmm. Weird. All right, two twenty figments missing, so it's more than I thought. I guess we broke his life. This is a very very good use of unsettling music. Well, you know, cute music that can be turned unsettling. I like that stuff in cinema cinematography in general. Usage of innocent music to I think I hear some emotional baggage nearby. It's got to have a name, right? To convey something really fucked up. Oh, they're all dolls. So, what did you think? Think, you're a very confused person, and you don't know what you're messing with. I'm going to restore a whole country to greatness. A country that your heroes, the Psychonauts, tore apart. Alright, so now, a fair to middling country at best. I mean, that or that. Rulovia was never great. It was always a fair to middling country at best. Please. Like I Serbia. was there, you weren't. It was amazing. I had a cotton candy maker in my bedroom. So he mixes up so he mixes up what he he felt in his own uh, his own experience with all the people. Remember, the people begged the Tsar for help. They were dying already, they were starving, and <laughs> the Tsar didn't want to, you know, drown people, but he pulled Maligula, well, Lucy, who was already, she wasn't feeling good, it was her homeland, so he was never supposed to push her, but he pushed her over the limit, and he was biting his nails afterwards. But the little guy saw that as, you know, we all lived in, 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 you know, we all lived in splendor and the country, you know, a beautiful country was killed. That's how he sees it. Hello, brother from another mother. Hello, good to see you, senpai. Hello, welcome. If I say hello one more time, you can call me Polly. Polly wants a crackhead? How you doing, senpai? How's your tired back doing? Tell me his dad sucked. <laughs> uh, but remember, he was a kid, so the whole point is to not point a finger at anyone. It's the combination of fac factors that brought here, 
He was a kid who didn't have a parent. So if things were different, maybe, maybe Crystal Malik would be an amazing human being. Well, very possibly so, you know? It all starts, yeah, it all starts in childhood. That's how you make a person like that. His dad was, his dad was so consumed by like keeping the power. He didn't have time for his kid who he kind of warped passively, so not actively, passively warped into this, into a fucking psychotic. Yeah. Well, that's a sad thing. Like, I, I think about it a lot. Where, where, where does the, where does the, your own personal, what's the word I'm looking for? When your, where you, when does your responsibility start and how far behind were you fucked into the choices you could, I mean, legacy of Cain lovers, we got to think that way, right? <laughs> how far behind were you pushed into good or bad choices without being aware of it now because you can't see the full picture you know god let's move on this music is gonna it just rip me from inside senpai yo no, i don't want to forget this one all right your dad was a brutal dictator and a ruthless strong man my father's only problem was that he wasn't strong enough as czar i won't have that problem trust me The people hated the Maliks. If that were true, then why did they unanimously re-elect <laughs> us every election? <laughs> oh, fuck off, game. Oh, it's so too personal here. A little too personal. <laughs> Where's Truman's brain? Not my problem. Your father used Lucretia Mux to squash non-violent protests. Maligula rained on a few parades, yes? Literally. Oops. Thank you, game. That's very nice of you. Battery dead. Pause the action. That's how you do it. Not battery dead. Fuck you. The game's gonna go on without you. Alright. Fresh batteries. Wah! At one point, yeah. Yeah. Well, normally developing brain. That's how it should be. But, you know, when things stand in your way of that... I wouldn't want to be him. I wouldn't want anybody to be him. But hey, it's like like all fantasy is based on reality, huh? Rooted in reality, almost. Pulled them down before they got too violent. Tsar Theodore made a monster. He pushed a vulnerable young woman to do such horrible things in the name of her country that she snapped. Yep. He broke her. He took a sad country girl and turned her into a mighty warrior. And I'm going to do it again. Differing perspectives. Playing with someone else's mind. Maligula is my grandma. <laughs> oh boy. Now who's confused? I've had enough of this. Yes. Me too. Hey! I'm not a puppet. I'll break out of this in two minutes and then you'll be sorry. That's all the time I need to have Truman extricate Maligula from her captors back in the physical world. No, please don't. He's aware. She's in a very fragile state right now. Any stress or memories could... Could awaken the Guardian of Grulovia and fulfill all of my hopes and dreams? You don't say. Please excuse me. I don't want to miss this. Hey, you jerk! Destroy your shop. Uh-oh. Not sure I should start a fire while I'm tied up. I should have stayed a little, but okay. Huh. I would have... Up here. Where? Oh, the fan? There you go. It's made with 
feel metal in the briefcase. <laughs> Come over here. Mm. <laughs> oh, she's got spirit. Look. There you go. It's one of the chests we use in Psychonauts. In the, yep, here we go. Back to real world. Were you children just inside the mind of the grand head of the Psychonauts? No. Darling, we saw you come out. That's an incredible security violation. Listen, that's the mole! Kid, you're way behind. The mole is Nick from the mailroom. Sasha just figured it out. But I always had my suspicions. Why, there he is, over there. No, that's the Zazarovich of Grulovia. Or at least his body. His mind is in my dad's head. Ugh, we don't have time for this. Let's go get my dad's brain. Out of my way. Did she just say? Ha. Huh. Gah. I think. Oh yeah, he was in we there. Get out of here. Here we go. The door has fallen off. Have you come to pay for your father's sins? Yes, High Priestess. I am here to correct the mistakes made by my father. I am Crystal Malek, son of Tsar Theodore, rightful ruler of Brulovia and servant of Maligula. Lucy, this isn't you. We can fight this together. Four. You are here too. This is awkward. Ah, there's so many people here. Too much baggage. Need to push it all away. Oh, coach. Nobody oh, listened really? to us. Wait. Time to face the granny. I'm gonna need some help. Ooh. Hey, what's back here? Huh? Is Maligula doing that? Of course she's doing that. She's got hydrokinesis. Ch -ch 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 why, why am I going that way? I, that's not what I wanted to know. Okay, it worked. Somehow. We're in the... We're in the... Not Green Needle Gulch. Yeah, we're in the Green, green Needle... In the Forgetful Forest. That's what I'm trying to say. That's a weird place to get stuck. That's a pretty cool way. <laughs> That's a pretty cool way to buy the last of stuff. Anything we can buy? Anything we need, really? You know what? Can't do that. But I can do, I can fill up my bag with the Tutti Fruity stuff. Oh, I didn't get the discount. Never mind. 
I don't know what I'll need for the final battle, really. Can't remember what I'll need, so... Uh... Look, look, so little left to, to, to finish it. Yeah, we're gonna need the family. Uh, the pins. I need the discount pin. That's assorted VIP discount. There you go. In the middle of a punch. Alright, what can we buy that we need? Pluck a ground, okay. Longer days, let's think about this. We can stop them, I guess. Okay, okay. So you can grab them. I've never done that in this play to really grab, like pull them closer with it. Though I should probably let's buy that. Well, that's pretty cool. I know what to buy that. That's yeah. I guess I could have done with this, but we're gonna be good. Don't worry, Otto. I won't. I'll be back in the shippy. I hope my family is still at the camp. Can you pause here? Yep, or we can pause. All right, just two minutes, folks. I really need to go to the bathroom. We'll be back with the Psychonauts finale in two minutes. Really fast. Don't go anywhere. And we're back, folks. That was the fastest bathroom rush I've had in a while. I think I broke a wall or something. <laughs> All right, let's finish this. I'm hyped the shit. Your father had a rough night. He's been remembering things. He's also remembering, huh? I lost her, Rasputin. They're all connected. I mean, with, you know, for, via Ford and all that. Thank you, Carter. So, yeah, we're gonna bring them, that's right. Oh no. You know what we have to do. They're all ragged. No tears, my love. It's showtime. Haha! -ha. Time for the devil's fire holes. Quippy, on the bottom. <laughs> With the booger. <laughs> Show him, Aquados. Crazy and Dion want to work together. That's what I was talking about a couple episodes yeah, back. Family. But what about all that water? The curse isn't real, Dad. It's just something Ford put in our minds to keep us safe. You sure about that? Of course he's not sure. But what choice does he have? Um, he's kind of sure. Here we go. You ready, Raz? No. So do it quick. <laughs> oh, ho, ho. Beautiful. All right. There's the whole that.
of exertion. You mean drowning? I can say drowning. What about the lungfish? <laughs> Even in the final boss area. Does the area have the name? Nope. It... Oh, wow! <laughs> kind of looks like the like the uh, lungfish battle area. That's right, and there's more where that came from. <laughs> Protests? Well, this is cheery. Oh, it's like the graveyard. Can't can make out the names Alex? Alex, I guess. Jabe? Oh, I guess. My grandparents were part of the protests in Grulovia after the war. It didn't end well. Here's a scene I was hoping not to see again. <laughs> That's Grandma and Grandpa. The real ones. Grandma Morona. My real Grandma Morona. And my dad's father, Lazarus. Nice to see them alive, actually. And they died. Why do they always show them in the bed as two skeletons? They were drowned in their houses? Well, they were part of the protest. Why would they be in their beds? I guess that's like they died together. You're in the way, Maligulugly. Maligulugly. Malugly. Yeah, I gotta practice that before I meet her for real. So there's gotta be something that leads somewhere. <laughs> Project Lazarus is on the way, Captain. Wait, 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 wait. Am I supposed to go back, I guess? Or just fall through the door? No? Oh! Stupid. There you go. Ooh, I'm gonna pay for that later. Rasputin is such a likable protagonist uh, Nona? the appearance the voice everything oh uh hi i'm raz i'm your great nephew <laughs> i mean not that i think i'm great or anything just that you're my grandma's sister and i'm here to talk you out of being evil because you know you're still family and all Family? All I see is another unruly Grulovian peasant. Uh, half Grulovian. Another little trash and he divorced from the streets. <laughs> oh boy. They're all gonna... Yeah. Bravo, Sam. You and your brother rule. Mental Esmeralda. Mental Esmeralda. <laughs> Careful, 
children. Borderlands envies these oh, intros. They, the voice actress just ruled, nailed the part. to her oh you can you can't you can't kind of slow her down oh you can you can you can hurt her I can't use mental connection on her, but I can use my little spammer. Oh, here we go, more. I don't know, lady. Have you tried eating prunes? The problem is she's all twisted up in knots. I got something that'll help you. Unwind. It's kind of unfair that they gave the uh, the these kids such a big role in the end, but the other kids in the first one, campers, were like, ah, shame. Ooh, that looks painful. It's okay. I have another one. Oh, dodge, Raz. I'm gonna need the fire. Oops, better, better fly now. So many puns. Alright, you just need to burn them. Wait, I got Cypops. I should use some Cypops. Huh? Bravo! I never thought of that. Hey, that little old lady's inside her. Now that you've seen that, I'm afraid I can't let you leave. Man, the animation just blows my mind. I know it's this is like from 2021, but even if it were Listen, from this you're a natural part year, of the fight or flight complex, but you're supposed to be small. Stay down in the primitive. Like, whoa, 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 whoa! Why couldn't I dodge? Oh wow, what was that? I was trying to punch her with it. Yeah, yeah, sorry. I, I keep forgetting because this is so exciting. <laughs> what does she see me as? I can't see. Because the, the, the snakes are fucking annoying. Protester. She sees a protester. Fuck, that cop. Oh shit, there's always three of them, right? I guess you guys just blast. Alright. Oh, she doesn't like lock on. <laughs> she does, doesn't she? Stay away from the water! <laughs> Alright, two more. It's Gisu and I didn't see who the other one was. Norma, yeah. <laughs> nice one. Granny gets slapped by the kids. Ooh, she looks teens. She was always a nerd. Oh, 
Oh shit. Yeah, she's like, she's not fucking around. I saw, I saw. Yeah, I saw, so I'm gonna need this and I'm gonna take this. I don't know if it actually hurts her, but. Wait, I need. Oh shit, alright, she just pushes me. Oh shit! Woohoo! Like, throw that thing at me, yeah! Alright, that works too. Just like. I guess. Yeah, I'm trying to. Whoa! Oh shit, I, gra I hate when he grabs the thing I wasn't even aiming at. Well, I got, that's why I got five of these, so I wouldn't have to think. Oh, it's too painful for her to remember, that's right. That's the fight or flight response. Matt would love this game if if he could get to, to see it. Nona, if you can hear me, this thing is not your fault. Ford's experiments opened the door and let it out of the lower brain. The sorrow in his war made it grow. I need my guy. Oh, fuck. Okay. Nice, thank you. Oh, can't send him to him. Wow, he sacrificed himself for him. You can't punch her. You just fly. There he is. Morris, I always forget his name. came to me, upset about some terrible mistake she had made. So we put the word out on KLOB, and guess what? People were listening. At least one of them. And they told the others. <laughs> Thanks, Morris. Oof. You owe me an exclusive on-air interview for this, okay? You got it, buddy. Okay, buddy. Bye. I'm guessing she just chases them out of their out of her psyche instead of killing them. I'm guessing because I finished the game before. <laughs> Marona wasn't supposed to be there. Gab. Lazarus shouldn't have brought her. He killed my sister. No, that's not quite right. No, that's not quite right. What do you listen? I... I killed my sister. I might not be your real grandmother. I killed my sister. But you're still my family! But so what? <laughs> I kill lots of people! How do you cope with it? Deny. Not a big deal. But you. The only thing I can offer now is everything. You bigger. It's okay, Nona. Look behind her. Yeah, this part of the battle is just <laughs> for fun. This is like <laughs> slapping Sephiroth. Yep, and we're gonna yeah. fill it. <laughs> Pyro Brad. <laughs> Push back. Shh. 
No, just can you jump? I think you can jump. Those, that's, those are not words, it's just like sound slavic, it's not saying anything really. Can you jump? Well, Grulovia, what is it supposed to be? Alright, time to punch the granny off the family tree. Oh, oh. Shapua! One last push. <laughs> there was a whole level in the first game that was Godzilla themed. What was it called? Godzilla. Cochamara. <laughs> Cochamara. <laughs> Gogalore. I am the Gogalore. We did it. I think I think that was the final part of the battle. Let's... Nona. You can't get rid of me. I'm a part of her. Big deal. Everybody's got something like you. We just know how to keep it where it belongs. Well said, Raz. Well said. GG, Granny. GG. That was amazing. Done. I don't have to play games anymore ever again. <laughs> Just gotta stop the controller from turning off. Thank you, Carter. Thank you. Thank you, my boy. Nona, Nona. She's gonna be fine. It's a pff. after all that they can't give us a sad ending. That was a fucked up, heavy story. Oh look, it's not a curse at all. It's hydrokinesis, one of the most interesting powers you never get to actually wield. <laughs> I got all the badges. Look at me. There's the brain. Yeah. Well, there's the old egg. Do you have a funnel? Yeah. So that's He's it. still in his bathrobe, I like it. gets to live out in Green Needle Gulch with Ford as if she didn't just try to kill people? What about you, Maury? <laughs> the way they look at him. <laughs> They're all super likable, man. We gotta play these games more. I think she deserves a second chance. <laughs> and I think I deserve a vacation. My brain's been through a lot. Well, it's oh, been through no, water. you don't. I've kept this place afloat during your little nap, and now I'm taking two of the 17 weeks of vacation I've saved up to lie in a beach where none of you can find me. Right after we take care of some important Psychonauts business. Uh-huh. Well, are you coming or not? Now that's leadership. Despite my best efforts, you interns have seen some really inappropriate things. But I think you've also learned a truth that every psychonaut should know. <laughs> that there are flaws in our most venerated institutions, in our heroes, and in ourselves. We all make mistakes, and we all need help sometimes. But we all <laughs> deserve a second chance. <laughs> you've seen us Fucking at our Dogans. worst. And we've seen you at your best. And I'm proud to say, you have all graduated from the intern program. Man, they did a lot for kids, not gonna lie. Teens, but still. Officially, junior 
agents of the Psychonauts. Junior, I'll take it. Finally, we got we got to that. Was that Truman Zanotto's signature? I think. That was amazing. Psychonauts 3, when? When Double Fine? When Tim Schafer? Peter McCollin? Not now when everyone's getting laid off. But the first next good year we won Psychonauts 3. Not a remake, not a reimagining, not a whatever kids these days like. A straight up sequel. Just a fucking sequel to a fucking amazing game. I liked it more maybe than the first time. Both games. Thank you guys, thank you. Yeah, zombie, we we defeated. Episodes. Oh yeah, there's the, there's gonna be another episode for the final collectibles. We are doing a 100%. So there is a post game. So it's gonna be a short episode. I, I assume it's gonna be a very short episode. We have very, very few collectibles left. But since we're doing a 100% run, we're gonna do that. I'm gonna think about it, maybe in some off-stream day, because it's supposed to be a, a very short stream, maybe... Maybe this Thursday, I'm not gonna say anything, we'll see. <laughs> Wait, zombie, there's 800 games more to play. <laughs> no, only Outbreak. <laughs> only Outbreak, huh? <laughs> Oof. I'm kind of sad to see it end, you know, when you like a game a lot, you want it to last. You don't want it to overstay its welcome, but the first the first one was is much shorter than I remember. We finished it in, we 100 percent the first game in ep eight episodes, in eight, in eight hippie episodes. That's like a one episode for a normal streamer. And this one was a little. Well, yeah, I, you know, I. I think we should enjoy these and not speedrun them. The only thing I can speedrun is Outbreak, honestly. Probably. Thank you! Oh, this whole time you played games? <laughs> these were games? <laughs> <laughs> what was it that Nephew Nemanja said? Museum, museum of questionable art, was it? Yeah, that made me laugh, that comment. <laughs> Yeah, they're the games from the Museum of Questionable. Bye. Right. Hey guys, thanks everyone. Thanks for thanks for sticking around. You know, I obviously like this game a lot. We've seen that with uh, <laughs> Psyching Sensorium, and you know, the, the entire game is just for me. It's if I'm if I'm paying fifty bucks for a game, I want it to be like this. Truth be granted, this was on Game Pass the first day one, I keep saying it. So if you still don't, haven't played this, both Psychonauts games, at least on PC and Xbox consoles, is on Game Pass. For PlayStation, I don't know what kind of de deal they have, but you know, look it up if you're interested. It's worth it. So yeah, that's all from me for today. Uh, tomorrow we're doing a fresh take on Couch Wednesdays. We're doing a versus game. Sasha's gonna beat the shit out of me in... Um, in uh, Dr. Mario, I was gonna say Dr. Outbreak, <laughs> Dr. Mario in Super Mario Virus Outbreak, it's gonna be a kind of an outbreak zombie, yeah, so that's gonna happen, and then Thursday, it's either we're going straight to Yoshi's Island, I think Yoshi's Island is gonna start next Tuesday, it would be fair, and uh, and finishing this on Thursday, whatever it is, it's gonna be on schedule, I'm gonna talk about it on, on this, I'm gonna talk about it on the <laughs> zombie, <laughs> On, on Discord and yeah, enjoy the ending. I don't know if there should be a post credit scene. I know there's a there's a post credit. Oh, there we're gonna find out. Nope, still more credits. All right, after the credits, we'll find out. <laughs> Let's see who we're gonna raid. Fuck, I forgot I should raid someone. So <laughs> into the game. Oh, we're supposed to raid people. Ah, oh. yeah. The first one had an amazing post credit scene that I totally forgot about. So I posted it as a... Uh... Oh, it's Jack Black singing. All right, I'm going to mute myself now.
Oh yeah, he was, yeah. Oh, Swayze is doing something new, huh? Yes, love? Yeah, I think so. I forgot. But, you know, if it's not now, it's going to be the next time. Let's let Jack Black sing. Say hi to Swayze if you're sticking around. And uh, thanks again, guys. Till next time. Unlocking all my memories, which are never, never bad.
know I graduated the intern program and all, but I'll bet if I snuck in a little extra credit work, that would really irritate Norma. <laughs>